All right, everybody, welcome to another YouTube video. Today, I'm going to do a comparison. It's a little windy here at the beach, but I want to do a comparison of the Vivitar. This is like their action camera, like a GoPro, basically. And then, it's not a fair comparison, but a GoPro 7 Black. Um, basically, I'm just going to record some different shots and let you guys be the judge to see if it's worth buying something like this just to use or upgrading. Okay, this is 60 frames per second. <laughs> Back with the wave. 60 frames per second recording time. All right, so basically my plan didn't go as I wanted to because the thing just stopped working. I've been having problems with it. I'm gonna take it back. But basically, look, it does this. I don't know if you can see where it says it's recording, but it's really not. So that test was a fail, but at least I got GoPro footage, which I'm gonna put in here, obviously, and show you guys what that looks like. Um, and I just recorded in 1080. It records in 4K, but I just did 1080 just to kind of keep it similar to this camera because this only records in 1080, so there'll be no point. It'll have to be scaled down anyway. But yeah, so leaving the beach now. All right, so we're at the Tampa Premium Outlets right now, and I'm gonna go check out the Nike store, but I'm probably gonna switch over to the GoPro. But I'll let you guys know what I am using and when I'm using this. Alright, we're about to walk into the next store right now. Doesn't make 
sense Doesn't make sense Doesn't make sense I don't really know Doesn't make sense Doesn't make sense Doesn't make sense I don't really know Whoa, man I just woke up From a fat nap <laughs> So I'ma make raps In my room <laughs> Yeah, I had my heart in fall, I'm down like waterfalls. You could have been my all. I guess it's not your fault. I had my heart in fall, I'm down like waterfalls. You could have been my all. I guess it's not your fault. Hey. Looking really pretty when I'm riding in the city with you You don't need a lot of makeup, you got nothing to prove You got a big heart, broken from your last dude I don't wanna say those words, but I have to move on And it's harder than you think when you've been doing all you can to be a thing I just wanna vibe with you, spend time with you I don't really get it, whatever we had a fling But now I'm good, you are great I spend my time living life in no way I'm on my grind, gotta do it my way Cause they say it might be impossible Running and running around, feeling unstoppable Nothing's been holding me down Know that I'll figure this out, I got you go I had my heart in fall, I'm down like waterfalls You could have been my all, I guess it's not your fault I had my heart in fall, I'm down like waterfalls You could have been my all, I guess it's not your fault I had my heart in fall, I'm down like waterfalls You could have been my all, I guess it's not your fault I had my heart in fall, I'm down like waterfalls You could have been my all, I guess it's not your fault Doesn't make sense, doesn't make sense. As you can see there wasn't too much inside the Nike store So now we're inside the Adidas store Seeing if we see anything but I don't know. It doesn't look too good right now. All right, everybody. So I'm back home now, and I'm actually charging the the little Vivitar just to kind of get um give you guys maybe hopefully try to get it to work a little bit to give you guys some idea of what it is um, because a lot of us you know can't really um, buy the expensive stuff or you know don't want to get in debt. Don't be like me. I get myself in debt way too much for no reason at all um so that's kind of my point of this um was going to be my point of this vlog slash video i kind of just wanted to give you guys you know a look so i'm charging up the vivitar hopefully i can get it to work inside here in a little bit more controlled environment with lighting and stuff like that um just to kind of give you guys an idea so i'm going to charge that up but right now let's switch over to the gopro okay so this is the gopro in like i said a controlled setting where i have lighting and, and everything like that this is the sound from the gopro that you're hearing um and just to give you guys a little bit of an idea if you would want to use this like i said i'm hopefully in the um i'll be um showing you guys what i used and everything now you can hook up an external microphone to this but i do not have that um the add-on that you need, a little uh, adapter that you need. So as of right now, I don't have the mic. I'm not using my microphone, my Rode mic, um, but this is just straight from the GoPro. So hopefully it doesn't sound too bad. And this is just an idea for you guys, if this is something you guys will want to use or vlog with. Um, I did get some stuff at the Nike store while I was there as a sample. And that's pretty much it. Um, so let's switch over to the Vivitar now. All right, so this is the Vivitar Full HD 1080p, it says, um, action cam. And I just found something out. So basically, when it didn't shut off earlier, um, it died completely. It just dies. And you just got to wait till the battery runs out. And... So I plugged it in right now and then it died on me again because I was just going to use it really quick. But I found out that you can actually use it while it's plugged up. So if you have like something like this, that's kind of convenient. I, I didn't know that. That's something I found out right now. So this is the audio of the Vivitar um, action, for, um, action camera. And obviously with the case on that comes with it, it's going to sound a little different. Probably muffled more. Not as good. 
Um, and I have used this in, in, if you watch any of my vlogs where I was swimming, I have used this a little bit. It's just the reason I stopped using it was just because of that reason that it wouldn't stop recording. And I'm pretty sure that's a, a defect that mo the cameras have. Um, so I'm, I don't know if I'll take this to Walmart and see if they get, get, I could exchange it. I've had it for a long time, but yeah, I'm going to try. Um, maybe I'll exchange it or maybe just get my money back if they let me. I don't know. Um, I don't have any of the plastic stuff. But yeah, this is a test, like I said, in the more control setting just versus the GoPro. As you can see, the GoPro is a little bit wide. But that is a function that you could um, kind of use um, to change that setting and, and whatever. And I really haven't messed with the settings that much on this. Um, but yeah, so... Nope, okay, it's still on. Let me turn that off. Turned off. Um, let me see what other tests I could run for this because, like I said, maybe I don't want to use it. So I'm going to just test the autofocusing. I don't know if, that, if it'll focus at all. Um, so this doesn't have a screen, obviously, so I don't know if it's recording or, or if it's doing anything. Um, but yeah, so this is the Vivitar. Now let's switch back to the Sony that I have. Alright, so we're back on. Uh, a normal camera and those are my tests um, I'm gonna say the GoPro is probably worth it for the price you know it's 350 um, so that's not that much of a price if you want to pay for that um, the Vivitar ran me about I think $59.99 which is kind of becomes a pain if it's messing up on you like it has been and didn't work luckily I was able to get the little bit of footage that I did um, and otherwise I don't know what I would have done my whole day would have been ruined which it kind of was because I didn't get to use it while I was out in water but like I said you could get a little bit of a feel for it it's a little shaky I would say the Vivitar is shaky GoPro amazing stabilization from what I saw from it like you couldn't even tell that you were moving at times because it was just so stable so that's the good thing about it um, would I use it for vlogging? The GoPro, yes, just because it's small. The only thing I don't like is I don't know if it has like a tripod. Um, as you can see for the Vivitar, I was able to put it on this little thing. Um, and you know, this, I don't know. I'll probably have to find something to, if I want to use it, you know, for something like that. Um, so it's, it's good. And then you can put the external mic on it. If you buy there's the, the adapter so that's a good thing um, so let me show you it would basically look something like this on top like that which I don't know people complain that this gets in the way of the camera I don't know um, so so that's a plus that the GoPro has over the Vivitar but like I said it's it's kind of you can't really compare them because a lot more goes into the GoPro versus the Vivitar but it's all about what you can handle, what you can afford, and doing things on a budget sometimes, you know. You see, you know, people can still just use their cell phone. Um, I uploaded my One Mexican Monday, the most recent one, just using my cell phone, using a, um, a, a, a app that I downloaded that I paid like $1.99 and I can change the settings and shoot 4K and everything. Um, so nowadays I just don't use my phone. I would use my phone more often. I just don't use it because of the memory issues and you know how, you know, even though I have 256 gigabyte phone, like it could still eat up memory. Um, so that's basically the reason why I don't use my phone and I have a million cameras now, probably more than I sh should have or ever need. Um, so with that being said, hopefully you like this vlog slash video review and if you were maybe considering a GoPro or a Vivitar um, my final analysis is get what you can afford use what you can afford um, but at the end of the day remember if you can save up it's probably worth getting the more expensive item if you if you can save up just because like you know I spent 60 if I would have saved up more just waited to save up more at the end of the day it might have been a better thing for me to save up and buy the better option versus you know spending 60 and I might have to still upgrade later on in the future for like a GoPro um, 
because it's messed up or something like that. Um, so it's always something to think about. It's all, it all just depends on you. And don't let, you know, even if you have to go for a Vivitar or something even worse, I don't know if there's anything cheaper out there, but don't let that stop you from not making content. You know, you can still do stuff. You can still put out content, whatever you need. And at the end of the day, that's all that matters. So with that being said, like, comment, subscribe, and we'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.